Hey guys, the DVD update here, or Matt here for another video. This is going to be kind of like a general video, a shopping video, uh, VHS uh, DVD Blu ray update, just real quick, with just to show off some items and stuff. Uh, follow me on Twitter, twitter.com backslash or forward slash zombie Matt. Find me on Facebook, you can if you find me on Facebook, or rather if you're kind of savvy, so do that. Um, if anybody doesn't know, probably about eight weeks ago I lost my full-time job that I had for eight years, so I've just been sitting at home watching Netflix and bumming around right now because I can't really find a, another job that pays the same, which is really sucky, but, uh, you know, I'm doing what I can, so that's pretty much why the DVDs and Blu-rays haven't been piling in like they used to. Um, I used to have, here to my bid back, if you go back and watch my videos, you could see that. Then I got it cut to shoulder, just above the shul, uh, short, and grew it back to shoulder length, which I just actually got it uh, all cut off, if you will. Um, because it's getting summer, it's getting hot, and also for the ladies. That's right, single again. Um, but actually, I've been getting noticed more with short hair. I think I do look better. So let's just get uh, going. I took a little shopping trip, got some DVDs and Blu-rays that were for sale at Best Buy recently. And so, well, first, uh, when I went out, I stopped at Walmart here, and I picked up this cool, let me see if I can pop up, Game of Thrones. Winter is coming, Stark. Uh, this wasn't on sale or anything. It was or in the T-shirt with the rest of the movie and um social media t-shirts that they have at Walmart and it was $7.50 so by no means was it on sale or anything but I picked it up because I want a Game of Thrones shirt and some fifty is not too terrible. Um, I also picked up this uh, this uh, shirt right here. It's the uh, sun, It's got the Sons of Anarchy logo and it says Sons of Anarchy in it. This was also at Walmart for $7.50. Um, if you recall last Blu-ray update that I did I got um, the a couple seasons of uh, that I needed of Sons of Anarchy and at Best Buy if you paid five extra dollars you got a Sons of Anarchy beanie which I've actually worn and it'll go that's a good companion piece right there and uh, just for fun um, I saw these in the uh, also at Walmart um, for three dollars um, two pairs of socks this one has stormtroopers on it and uh, Darth Vader um, and then I got a, a second one which has this one has uh, Spider-Man and Iron Man and uh, Captain America and I'm currently I don't know if I can do this you know I'm not as young as I used to be but I'm wearing Marvel ones right here as you can see this is Marvel Comics right there and it has the Avengers uh, all the Avengers on on socks so more nerd stuff for me to wear basically and then I picked up these uh, command velcro strips which is what I use to hang my movie posters so then I headed over to Best Buy because I saw on the sale paper that uh, Father's Day is coming up and I saw on the sale paper something that me and my dad and my mom like to watch together and my dad likes to watch. So I figured I'd pick up the season sets for him on DVD and that of course that of course is like you would know but you wouldn't but I'm going to tell you what it is right now. You would not know this. So, But uh, Duck Dynasty Season 1 and Duck Dynasty uh, in the paper or the ad it said... Um, season two but this is season two volume one so they split up the second season into two volumes which i'm never a fan of this is a show on a and e um about a uh family who uh, makes duck calls and are millionaires and things like that so it's a very very good show of course my favorite like many people is Psy. um but uh i started watching this at work because we were just bored at work and we had TV there, and so it was on. I think it came on Wednesdays or something. We watch it every Wednesday, and actually grew to really like it. And then uh, I was watching one time. My dad came in, and he la He sat with me and watched it, and he laughed for a bunch. And then he started watching it on his own. And then we started watching it together, and uh, uh, I catch him watching it on his own reruns all the time. I'm like, haven't you seen that episode already? And he's like, yeah, but I wanted to watch it again. So, uh, well, now go for it, buddy, because for Father's Day I got you uh, uh, Season 1 and the first part of Season 2 so you can rewatch it to your heart's extent. So next, also at um, Best Buy, uh, they have a thing going on for, uh, there's some are $7.99 and some are $9.99, but it's buy one, get one free for a certain selection on Blu-rays. If you look at the ad, they only show like six or seven items, um, but it says if you want a full list of items, go to the website or in-store and so I went in-store because I wanted to pick up this one um, I know it's on Netflix right now but um, I wanted it just for my collection and Ryan Gosling it's Ryan Gosling and Drive very good movie I really enjoyed it and then so I really didn't find another one that I wanted for in the free section 
Um, whether I had them already or they just weren't my type of movie that I wanted to own. Uh, what I would have ended up going with was Underworld. They had three of the Underworld films, and I'm not really a fan of the Underworld series. The first one was okay, but I didn't quite care for any of the others. But I only saw the second one, so I can't really say about the third one. But, um... Kate. Oh, back in cell. Anyways, um, sidetrack. She's hot. But then I looked down, and I saw this, which surprised me. And it was Robert De Niro in Taxi Driver. Um, and this is the little gatefold book. So I got this for free, or I got Drive for free, whichever one you want to say. And I had previously had this version of Taxi Driver, which is I got for like five dollars at on the Walmart bin. Um, this is like the special, the collector's edition DVD, that like slides out and whatnot. It's not even opened because I saw that I actually saw that this movie in theaters, which was pretty cool just a couple months ago. Um, Played over there in St. Louis, Late Night Grindhouse. Check that out. What should I go with next? I guess we'll do this. Screen Factory release of Phantasm 2. Pre-ordered this when I had money. <laughs> and so I got it mailed to me. Of course, it comes with a nice slip case. Like in the Screen Factory releases for sure. And since I pre-ordered it from the official website, I got the cool little mini poster. Unfortunately, one of my favorite movies of all time, The Burning. Uh... Hold on, let me show you the Phantasm poster there. Uh, the Burning, I wasn't able to pre-order that to get the poster, so that sucks, but, you know, you pick and choose when you're low on cash. I'll just pick it up for $20 on Amazon when I can. Now, as I was leaving Best Buy uh, by the registers, I saw some Game of Thrones and Sons of Anarchy merchandise that they were selling there, and uh, I looked at it and uh, thought this was interesting. Um... For five dollars, I think it is, or something along those lines. Maybe it was five ninety nine. They had this um, Sons of Anarchy uh, USB wall charger. Plug it into a wall outlet, and then you plug it in any USB chargeable device, and uh, it charges your USB device. So it can charge my iPhone, anything that basically be, is charged by USB. So I thought that was pretty cool, and it was pretty cheap, and it has the Sons of Anarchy logo on it there. So that was pretty cool. And um, I actually saw this. I needed a wireless mouse because the desktop I bought re uh, recently. Um, came with a wired mouse and, and keyboard. So they had this, which is a Sun Ar uh, Sons of Anarchy wireless USB mouse and mouse pad. Um, this is a very interesting story. Uh, so anyway, let me show you the design real quick. You can see that. It's got the Reaper there, fire coming up. It says Sons of Anarchy. And uh, sorry if you can't really see it, but under him it says Fear the Reaper, and he's riding a motorcycle. So I thought that was pretty cool, but it was weird. There's another mouse there that had the Sons of Anarchy um, logo on it, like the shirt I showed previously. But the mat wireless mouse and mouse pad for that was $39.99. $39.99. I'm like, what the fuck? They had this one for $9.99. I don't know what's up with that. This is the cooler design, I think. Then I went over to the Game of Thrones section, and they had a Game of Thrones USB charger that was smaller than this guy and they wanted like $15.99 for it when this one was $5.99 or something like that no and they wanted $40 for both of their wireless mouses for Game of Thrones no thank you I'll pay $10 I'll, I'll sure I'll pay $9.99 for Sons of Anarchy mouse pad and wireless mouse because I needed one and it gets me points on my card for Best Buy. Next up, I ordered this. Um, it was on sale a while back on iNet Video, uh, so it came from. That means it comes from. It came from Canada, but I think it was fifteen dollars, and I got free shipping because I used the promo code that uh, your first. If you use your first order, you get free shipping. It wasn't my first order, but I just used a different email address, so I kind of cheated there. But hey, that's life. You know what I'm saying? Um, I ordered enough stuff through there. Uh, the free shipping is not going to hurt them any. So it was this, and it's the Scream box set here. Um, it, it was much bigger than I had anticipated. And I think uh, Chris Rav showed this off in a video um, at one point, but um, when I saw it for $15, I was like, okay. I just recently watched Scream 1. Uh, all of them are on Netflix, I think. Maybe 4 is not, but I'm not sure. But I watched Scream 1 on Netflix the other night. But uh, anyway, I got this in the mail. And uh, it comes with a full-size mask that you can wear. And it comes with screams 1 through 4 and a bonus disc. Um, let's go ahead and open. I'm not going to take out the mask because it's a bitch to get back in. I'm going to try to take out this, though. But it's um, 
and here's what the Blu-ray looks like. It's actually in a black Blu-ray case, which is actually pretty cool. Uh, it's also in French and English. Damn Canadians. Uh, but it's in one of those little, uh, l a little bit larger spined uh, Blu-rays so that it can fit all the discs. Each film is on its own disc. There's Scream, Scream 2, Scream 3, Scream 4, and the bonus disc. Um, I just checked some of the special features. They have trailers, TV spots, outtakes, gag reels and some of them. Uh, they have direct, the commentaries and things of that nature. Uh, and from what I spot checked, uh, the picture quality looks pretty good. And the sound quality, I really didn't check because I was just skimming through. Um, so I'm not a hardcore screen fan, but I do like some of the movies. I don't really remember um, two or three that much, but I do like them. And I like very liked, much liked four. I saw that in the theaters. So for $15, sure, I'll pick it up and it comes with a little uh, ghost face mask if I want to wear it. Another cool thing is, um, so each one of those has their own special features, TV trailers, things like that, as I said, um, making ofs and whatnot. But on the very last disc, which is the um, uh, bonus feature uh, disc, which is also a Blu-ray, it's not a DVD, um, it has the two hour and 30 minute documentaries made um, about the Scream franchise. Uh, one is called, I think, Still Screaming, and the other one um, slips my mind at this moment. But uh, maybe I can find it on here, but I don't have much space on my camera hard drive left. It's not telling me. It's not telling me at all. Oh, wait, here it is. Still Screaming and Screamed Inside Story. They're both running about an hour and 30. Uh, minutes, so I think that that would be interesting to see. And then I went to a local video game store because I needed to pick up something for my PS3, um, and I found uh, this VHS for two dollars, and it uh, it's it stars um, Tracy Lords, Ricky Lake, and Ted Raimi in Skinner. Go ahead and pull that up. So it's five dollars, but all VHS were on sale for three. So as you can see, Tracy Lords, Ricky Lake. There's uh, Tracy Lords, there's Ted Raimi right there. I don't think it shows Ricky Lake on the, on the back here. But, um, he'll get under your skin. Right on. And then I uh, saw a movie, Cassandra, which I actually have the original poster for this. The poster looks pretty cool. It was for $3. It's the Video Treasures release, though. It says, Young and Beautiful, She Envisions Death. I've always wanted to see this movie. The poster is really cool. It's got the eye there. Sandra's all, all written like that and not fire and whatnot. Yeah, I'm explaining to you what's on the cover. Okay, so I mean that's just a real quick DVD Blu-ray update. There's DVDs in there, Blu-rays in there, clothing items in there, stuff like that. So uh, thanks for watching. Um, I should have some more videos coming up. I have some more standee videos coming out. Uh, maybe a poster, uh, show off some more of my posters, a horror movie memorabilia or something like that. Who knows? Um, I have a house specific video, the 1987 um, house movie specific video coming out because I have a couple of horror memorabilia items linked in with the house. I figure I'll do a review of all four of the house films and integrate my memor horror memorabilia for house uh, in there as well for like a, a cool type of video. So that's it for Matt here, the DVD update. As always, don't forget to comment, rate, subscribe, do what you do, and I'll see ya when I see ya. So um, this has been Matt, the DVD Update. As always, thanks for watching, and uh, don't forget, wow, I just fucked that up.